This question asks us to find the equation of the normal to the curve y equals 16 minus x squared, where x equals 4. So the normal is a straight line. So we should be thinking about using y minus y1 equals m plus x minus x1. OK. So in this equation, we need to know x1, y1, and m. x1 is the x-coordinate of the point that we're interested in, where the normal passes through the curve. So x1 is going to be 4. I can get y1 by substituting x1 into the equation of the curve. So y1 is 0. Before we go any further, let's just draw a quick sketch. So this is a quadratic with minus x squared, uh, which means it's an n-shaped quadratic, and the 16 is the y-intercept. So if we were to draw the tangent at the point 4, 0, that would be the line that we would get. And if we were to draw the normal, which is perpendicular to the tangent, that would be the line that we get. So this is the equation, this is the line whose equation we want to find. OK, we have x1 and y1. Now we need m. I'm going to put a little subscript of n for the gradient of the normal. What we're going to do is differentiate the equation of the curve to find the gradient of the curve at this point as a, a stepping stone to getting the gradient of the normal. So y is equal to 16 minus x squared. So therefore, dy dx will be minus 2x. Now I can say that when x is equal to 4, that tells me that dy dx is going to be equal to minus 2 times 4, which is minus 8. Because the tangent and the curve meet at the point 4, 0, the gradients will be the same there. So I can say that mt for the gradient of the tangent will be minus 8. But then we want the gradient of the normal and we're going to find it by using the fact that they are perpendicular. So the gradient of the normal will be the negative reciprocal of the gradient of the tangent. So in this case it will be minus 1 over minus 8, which is just 1 8. Now we've got the, uh, the gradient of the normal and we have the x and y coordinates of a point that it goes through. We can substitute those in to our y minus y1 equals m x minus x1 and get the equation. 
So we can say that the normal has this equation. Y minus zero is equal to an eighth, which is the normal's gradient, times x minus four. is equal to an eighth times x minus 4. And that's the equation of the normal. And we'll stop there.